everyone. Happy IO Tuesday. Uh, this week I teamed up with my coworker Blake. He put together this beautiful mountain scene made out of reclaimed wood and he asked if I would add some LEDs that we can control over the internet. So the whole thought of this project was to get electronics into something where you might not expect to see them, like a reclaimed wood mountain scene. And I've always been intrigued of this past SparkFun video where they pulled in local weather data to control LEDs where they put inside of this cotton fabricated cloud. And so what I wanted to do is to take that concept and put it into here, where we would pull in local weather data and then control the LEDs that are behind these mountains and up in this area. And what that would do is give a different scene to the sky region here. So essentially my part of this project was to construct this and it was pretty simple. Essentially what I did is make an outline of how I wanted each layer of the mountain scene to look. Then I used my jigsaw to cut out the angles and then wood glued and stapled the joints together. The different layers were then stained, sanded, and scraped to keep that nice weathered look. Once Blake brought his project into work, it was time for me to add the electronics. He explained to me how he wanted the visualization to look, and what we decided was that the sky area would be where you would see the weather. In order to get this effect, I added LEDs under the lip over here facing downwards and behind this mountain ridge facing upwards. With the LEDs facing each other, they project light all the way throughout the sky so you get a full effect. I also added an LED strip behind this mountain ridge and this mountain ridge, but those face backwards and what that does is it adds a little bit of ambient light. Then it was time to get to programming. I used the particle photon because it's an easy board to connect to the internet. I wanted to connect it to the weather underground service, so I used IFT as an easy protocol. I created a whole bunch of applets that update my particle photon anytime there's a change in weather. Then it was time to animate the LEDs. I knew that Blake wanted the sky in the mountain range to look like the sky outside. So we started by looking at a bunch of pictures of the Rocky Mountain skyline when it rains, when it snows, during sunrise, during sunset. Each LED animation is triggered when Weather Underground sends an update to my particle photon through IFT. Share your thoughts with us in the comments below.